Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 2 of season 5 of Don Machi. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. No. Talk. Probably threaten you, but to talk. Yeah. We can't talk about that guy. You know, that's probably like a big, big spoiler, right? too late you're you're doing it you can't refuse either go on the date or die you don't want to die don't you right i mean like do you want to make her cry do you want to be known as the fucker who makes someone cry? No. Don't do that, guys. <laughs> and besides the girl that you're in love with, I, I don't even think she's showing up in this season. Is that, is that, is that showing up in this season? All right, right. Ah, 
<laughs> oh my god. Why did I have a feeling this is gonna happen? Do not make me Oh my god, I'm falling for him again. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my What? Steve, that's like how, oh my god, limited edition boba. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, wait, I'm going to, oh, I'm getting boba tomorrow? Yeah, what well, today? <laughs> oh, wait. I can't get the map. Oh, the map the metaphor. Girl has one. I'm sorry. I still need to finish playing the demo. Oh, it looks yummy. Oh. Yeah, it looks really yummy. It kind of reminds me of... Okay. You know how on TikTok recently everybody wants to like candy eyes everything? Like candy pizza, candy whatever, and such. Which... Why would you do that? Like, you know what's really far and I just recently found out? People now want to... Aww. Candy Chipotle. What is wrong with y'all? Exactly. Candy Chipotle in a nutshell. Why are you eating things that have, like, no. Why are you making things candy-fied? And then trying to eat it. Do you not care about your health? Ladies and gentlemen.
Bell. I mean, damn, is her boobs just gonna be- JESUS CHRIST! I'm hungry. I I should go eat. I can't eat now, but I'm hungry. Five hours are. Oh, she looks so cute. from the pretty her day to freaking Don Machi day and I fucking love it cuz like oh my god Mm. The bread, so good. I want food. I'm hungry. Feed me.
Everybody take notes. Take notes. It's going to be on the quiz. Yes. Like, get the fuck out. <laughs> Thank you.
Just once. We got any effing stuff right here? You sure effing aren't. <laughs> Okay. I love the fact that, you know, this date, or just, once again, let's just talk about dates in a nutshell. This was cute. Very, very cute. But once again, you give me the freaking friendship and the romantic date and fucking pretty care, and then we continue with Don and Don watching, and it's just like, oh my god, it's too fucking much. Thank god he didn't let me cry. Okay? The last three weeks were pretty here. I've been a hot freaking mess and I don't want to talk about it because like every single week I end up crying. We're about to go into week four this weekend and I'm about to be a hot mess again because of the damn show. Now this, like I said, this was cute, but don't like the fact that freaking Freya Familia is like all up on her and Belle. I get it because... Of situations, who she is, da, 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 da. I'm guessing other spoiler situations that we cannot talk about, obviously, um, due to you know <laughs> being anime only. Yes, but it just it reminds you almost like think about any royal or even hell a celebrity who's really really popular. They have a lot of security. Excuse me. They have a lot of security around them and they don't really have like the time to just be themselves or be like in a moment of peace and such. And that's why sometimes, um, especially if we're talking about royals in a nutshell, like they literally try like their hardest not to tell, you know, everyone else like, oh, hey, I'm going somewhere. You don't need to know. I don't want security following me. But because of the fact that you never really know when the world's going to happen, that's really the biggest reason why they have security following them everywhere that they go. Um, I can't say the same thing for like celebrities. I can maybe for some of them. I don't really know. It just depends because like the last video of a celebrity that I watched that had their own security guard was, I think it was Cardi B going to Disneyland. D hold on. D Disneyland's here in Florida, right? And Disney World's in California? Then it was Disney World. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. And the funny thing was, like, the security guard rode the ride, too, which is freaking hilarious. But, no, like, I, I really do feel for her. She feels like this trapped princess who just wants to be let out. She's not a freaking... She's like a Rapunzel, a freaking... You can't say Cinderella, because Cinderella... Well, yeah, you can say Cinderella. Literally any princess in a nutshell who's, like, trapped in a freaking tower wanting to, like, have some sort of freedom. Um... But, you know, the wicked stepmother. But in my, my opinion, Freya is not a bad person. I'm just saying. Now, I don't know what she's capable of in this season. Once again, you know. <laughs> Inquiring minds want to know. Yes, 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 yes. Um, but I don't really think she's a bad person. But at the same time, you know. Who knows? I may be looking at her a completely different way by the time we finish this season. Um, but who knows? Very much, who knows? Like, mm. once again, we're in a territory that, like, every single week, like, I have, I have to guess. Like, I, I still have no idea what the freak is gonna happen. The opening gives you, <laughs> gives you nothing and everything at the same time. You think it's gonna answer all your questions, but no, an opening will never really answer your questions, no matter how many times you look at it. It's only if, when you get those answers in the episode, then, you know, the opening is like, yes, you know those questions that you were wondering for a really long time? Yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes. 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 We're going to answer them now. Like I said, big thing, Hesia, what you doing this season? Because, like, Hesia is about to become, I don't know what the heck she about to become this season. We're only on episode two. About to go on episode three by Thursday while I'm at work. I need answers. To mother effing day. Yes. Y'all are gonna, I swear, I swear, I swear, I swear, I swear, I swear to all the holy. Y'all are, this series is just gonna make me say the words, fuck it, and I'm going to read the book series and such. I'm trying my hardest. 
I am trying my freaking hardest not to read it because I don't want to know. I don't want to have another moment like I did with my hero and knowing all this stuff and then just be like, and such. I don't want to turn it into, well, thank God I never what? No. I never read Seven Deadly Sins. <laughs> We're not going to talk about that. But no, I don't want it to be like that. So I'm trying my damn hardest not to read the source material. Definitely read that source material for Yamada Kimi now. <laughs> if that show ever gets a second season. But no, like seriously, this was a good episode and such. I just... You, you ended it on the point that I wanted more. Like, remember how in that one episode of Spy Family when, like, Yor and Lloyd went on a date and I was like, all right, I need more? And then you didn't give me more? That's where we are. I need more. Thank God it's Wednesday. <laughs> but other than that, guys, that is my reaction to with episode 5 of season 2. What the fuck, Nisha? Episode 2 of season 5 of Don Machi. Because if this was season 2... If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day. Join the Magic Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all tomorrow um, when I come home from work for episode 3. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!